Hi, this is Mohamed Shakil here and today I'm going to show you how you can insert a logo in the drafting workbench of KTMA5. So to start off, let me open up a drafting workbench. And uh, in here, uh, before inserting a logo, uh, let me just uh, insert some uh, frame and title block. So to do that, I have explained in detail previously. In my previous video, you can go back to my previous video to see how you can insert the title block and the frame. So let me do it uh, faster over here. So I'm just uh, doing a sample here. So we have some sample being created here now and uh, the place where we are going to insert the logo is uh, somewhere over here and here we'll have the description and uh, some uh, you know, so and so some more details. So let's see how you can insert the logo. So you can insert a company's logo in the title block. To do so, invoke the background editing mode and then choose uh, the insert object from the menu bar so you should make sure that you are in the background editing mode right now we are in the background editing mode because I've invoked that for inserting the frame and title block previously so select the create from file radio button to insert a graphic created earlier so I'm going to insert object and we have this create from file over here radio button so in this manner you can uh, locate your um, you know logo file which you have created previously so uh, this is a pretty simple method so in this video I'm going to show you how you can create your own logo uh, instantly uh, by using any of these uh, uh, softwares so whatever softwares are available in your uh, uh, system will be shown over here you can select any of them so I'm going to select the paintbrush from this so I'll click on the paintbrush make sure that you are in create new and click OK and you can see your paintbrush tool is opened over here so let me just uh, create a random uh, logo uh, over here So I'll use a paintbrush and uh, I'll give some colors for this. So I know that it doesn't look like a logo but still I'm just uh, creating. Uh, the main thing is that you should understand the concept uh, rather than uh, whatever logo which I'm creating because uh, this is just uh, an example. So uh, let me just uh, give a letter so that it looks like a logo. So uh, it's here. So uh, this is uh, our sample logo here. So once you're done with the logo, just click on the save button here. Once you're done, just minimize, and you can see your logo is being created and it's been placed on bottom left corner of your KTIV5 drafting screen. Now you can resize your logo like this and you can place it according to whatever you require and once you're done you can uh, insert the names uh, the uh, whatever name you want to put for that so safety evolve something uh, say whatever you want to put So you'll be placing it somewhere 
whatever you, whatever you want and then uh, you'll be inserting your uh, name revised by uh, revised by shift enter shift enter okay that's how you can uh, uh, give more I mean uh, on the same box you can give a lot of uh, I mean, more wordings so you have this uh, rise by Mohammed Shakil Aziz as my name written over here and once you're done with everything you just have to click on working views and you're done thank you for watching